It's good to go, right? So uh, let's get started. Let me share the screen. And before I uh, share, I would like to ask you some sort of questions regarding because I want to you know, have interaction. I want to have a word with you. Said, so why do you want to learn the voice and accent? And what is your ultimate goal? To be very honest with you, since I have been in teaching profession, so what I strongly believe, I want to work upon my communication skills since I have been in the profession. So I have to guide a lot of people. And I realized while teaching my learners, the only thing that I feel that I need to give to my learners is voice and accent because a lot of people came to me and asked me about voice and accent training and other things as well. And I feel that whatever I know, whatever I have learned, I just worked upon myself over the past few years only then I could get the level that I have got right now to interact with one person to other person. But when it comes to provide additional knowledge to people, okay, just for the same purpose, I want to get its training completely because I have never taken any kind of voice and accent training from any center till yet. And uh, I just watched some of your videos on YouTube, on Facebook. So I got completely influenced after watching your videos that how important it is to work on voice and accent. So I thought of taking a training and I thought that you would be the best option for me. Okay. Where I can simply approach to guide me or to train me exactly the requirement that I have got right now. And fortunately you got my requirements and you are going to train me. How exactly am I supposed to teach my learners in future? Great. So that's, you know, to be honest and uh, having a candid behavior, I would say people are not aware about voice and accent training. Yeah, they just think, you know, I uh, just only pronouncing any specific word as per the any articulation formations, but that's not a fact. The way, you know, it doesn't matter how much credibility you have. It doesn't matter how much influence you have. Nobody's going to ask you even, right? But the way you start speaking, the way you start uttering your single word, that will be moment, you know, when people would say, that's the person, right? Because this is the, and just uh, like I said, alfazo ke alag zaike hote hain. Par usne se pehle, Chakna bahut hota hai, right? Absolutely. Because koi bhi cheez, once you speak, can't take it back, right? And that's why we need to be very gentle, polite, and you know, the praise what is on behalf. Okay, so let's get to go. And what kind of session do you actually provide, you know, to your students like here? Yeah, spoken English, grammatical aspects, competitive examinations, training, and uh, corporate training. What exactly? Do. See, basically, I provide the education to my learners. It is completely about smart learning and uh, like uh, advanced learning where I just make them work upon their communication skills and I teach them spoken English, like completely I deal with spoken English where I have to teach them grammar, intermediate English as well. Other than that, I just make them work on various activities that I can uh, help them to develop their communication skills in order to face like uh, some interviews. Most of the times what happens, GD sessions are held debate sessions are held. So basically I just need to help them out to understand some of the key points which are highly required, especially when we are doing debates and GDs that most of the people like in those points. Other than that, uh, basically I, like, I have been working on spoken English. I just teach grammar, intermediate English and spoken area. So these all are such things that I have been working on. That sounds really great because you know the way you have been working basically around the clock until the work gets done and uh, I would believe that, you know, uh, no matter you are in a tight corner, you are trying to set your position up to the mark, right? And this is something which is, which sounds really incredible for me as well. So, okay, so it's good to go. And uh, since you have responsibility on your shoulders and one word you have pronounced like it's developed, it's the developed and it's developed, right? There are two variations over there. So don't worry about that. You will get to know the technicalities. So shall we move ahead, right? Sure. Of course, of course. So this will be your examination. This will be first test. And I am going to teach you in the same way as you would teach your students to the voice and accent training. Okay. Sure. So first of all, we need to identify, we need to get the idea that how much, you know, the knowledge you have about pronunciations, about the consonant sounds, about the vowel sounds. So what we will do here is we will try to create a kind of test but in that I will give you a kind of a set of words in that I will be, you know, going through you in that situation that somebody that fricates, some will be there, you know, glottal sounds, the consonants, the vowels, diphthongs. It means there will be a variety of things that will be amalgamation of different, different sounds so that I can easily catch your attention. And I will also, I can see the mouth position. So there will be two different evaluations over there that I'm going to do for you. First, your sound testing and then evaluation of your mouth position. Then you need to do the same thing, right? Okay. Are you ready for that? And so one more thing before we start, like whatever the thing that you want me to write on your notebook as a note. So please let me know as well so that I can write all the things that are required since. Yeah. 
as I told in the beginning, right? So you need to teach your students in the same way. You know, right. you can listen to me and simultaneously you need to make some notes. It should be, you know, spontaneously, right? Okay, simultaneously, no worry about that. So just write down uh, how you need to conduct the sessions. And uh, I'm pretty sure that after completing your program, like five to six months, you would be able to you know, train your trainees and your journeys as well. So great. And this is our spirit, right? Yes. Let's get started. Okay. So can you see the PPT? Uh, not yet. It's written English at work. Place has started a screen sharing, but I'm not able to see anything right now. It's taking a little time to open, I think. All right, no worry about that. Yeah, I can see PPT right now. Yeah, this, this one, right? So do we have to write all these things? No, no, no. I will send you this PPT. Okay, okay, sure. Don't worry about that, right? I have everything written.